What is going on lads? Welcome back to another video. Once again, a personal box as always. I do plan on doing more videos with, with like checklist reviews or whatever it may be. Anything card related, maybe a PC, maybe a highlight video of our best pools from breaks. But this time we have a little Barcelona box. I don't even know, Barcelona set up opening. Um, 50 cards plus one exclusive parallel and you can get all those in these. I haven't really seen anyone open these, but I have seen some cards going around with Pedri autos or I don't know, there, there are probably other autos, I think Langlet autos, I don't know what I've seen exactly, but I've seen some autos, so there's definitely autos in here. Um, pretty interesting box, they've been out for a while already, I've had them on my shelf for a while, I just thought let's open two for a video, and if it does well, maybe we'll do another two, as you can see I have four total, not too many. Didn't really stack up on these as I didn't really see a lot of value in them. But we're just going to be opening two of them. And we will see what we can pull from these. Uh, they also don't have a seal as we're used to from top. So I guess they don't really value these team sets as highly as, you know, actual boxes. Because usually they of course have that complete wrapper around them. This time these are just sealed with some, some stickers. I don't know how to best open these. I'm guessing this way. Something like this. Alright, there we go. So they're, they're in like this. Completely different packaging than what we're used to, but it will do. I'm not sure on which side the parallel will be. I hope it's at the back. So we don't get any spoilers here. Let's get this box out of the way. There we go. Um, interesting cards. I, I haven't seen these base cards either, so it's going to be a complete surprise for me. I don't want to ruin it for myself when the parallel is on the back. So I'm just going to open it like this. Maybe I should have watched a little video to see where the parallel is at, but we're going to find out together. Yeah? If this is the first time you're watching any of my videos, make sure you hit the subscribe button. I plan on doing many more of these. I think that is a parallel, or maybe that one is a parallel. I don't know. We're about to find out. Here we go. All right, so Neto, Aguero. Ooh, these are nice. What's this? This is a Barcelona, Spain. All right, interesting. There's a Balde. A rookie. So there's a lot of cards in here. I'm guessing it's just the entire base set or something. And then a parallel at the back. I hope there's not a parallel. Wow, there's a nice card. Nice design. Really nice. I'm of course not going to be breaking any of these. But they are nice to have. Probably some of them, if we get a good parallel auto, they will go up on the site. Controlbreaks.com. That's also where you can get involved with our breaks. So... Make sure you do if you're interested. We have, um, oh, these are nice. Awake it, Pedri, Dest, Frankie. Of course, we do have some interesting breaks coming up, also from Tops Gold. Those are arriving this week, which is beautiful. They seem to be even better than Deco in my eyes. At least the base card design looks really, really good on those. Oh, even Kuman has his card. I bet these were printed when he was still the manager. So it looks like the parallel is indeed at the back. We have one more, that's a home kit, and then here's our parallel. Doesn't look like we have an auto or anything. Bang. Short the Alba to 275. That is absolutely shocking. I think it's at the 275. Yep, one for nine of 275. Well, that should tell you how many of these were printed. Of these boxes. I think that probably means there is a shit ton of these going around which probably also means that price of these will stay where they are i guess because you can get pedri autos i've seen that but i'm guessing they're gonna be extremely rare to hit if there's parallels like that floating about here we go box number two can we hit a parallel that's the, the main question here if you've opened any of these yourself make sure to let me know in the comment section, let me know what you pull. Always interesting to hear. And I always read the comments as well. Alright, let's see. Once again, well, that looks like a different parallel. Alright, interesting. I'm guessing these are all the same. Same order. It does look like that. Yeah. Then the Kuman here. In a second. Oh wait, you already went past it, I think. Wait, maybe it's different. Maybe there are some different inserts. Or maybe not. I am confusion. No, maybe not. 
Uh, actually. Yeah, they are. They are a bit different, but HomeKit is at least in the same spot. Oh, this is an interesting parallel because it's going sideways. Is it one of those? Oh, it's the Steg in Barcelona, isn't it? Yes, it is. The Steg in Barcelona to 75. Now, that's not bad for a Barca car. I'm sure some Barca collectors will be interested in this. So if you are, make sure to leave a comment or send me an Instagram message or Facebook message wherever you are able to reach me. Not bad. Also, I didn't update the bottom bar, like the orange bar at the bottom. It still says Deco. Deco brakes are no longer. But we've, we've only done two boxes. I think we're just going to rip these as well. I planned on doing two. We may as well go all the way. Here we go. I don't. I just figured I don't have to open both sides. I can just open one side and then get the guys out. I'm such an idiot. Here we go. We're just going to open all these boxes. Four boxes. I don't want to spoil the back. Here we go. Can we hit an auto? That's the, that's the main question here. Yeah. So, once again, these are all that base. All about that base. No trouble. Oh, yeah. These are sometimes different order, I guess, but they do seem very similar. I guess, well, they are the exact same, I think. Yeah, they actually are. Oh, we may have an auto because usually there's only one car behind this and it looks like there's two now. There we go. We probably have hit an auto here. Oh my goodness, a purple Pedri. I'm not sure what that's going to be number two. But that is interesting. And then an auto. Who's that going to be? Wow. Yusuf Demir auto and... Pedri to 99. What a box that is. Bang, bang. And this Demir Auto is to 200. Wow. I think that is an absolute bang. I think Demir actually left. I'm not sure where he went. I think he was left on loan. I could be completely off here. I need to do more research, I guess. But wow. I'm pretty impressed with the, with the quality on these cards. They actually are really, really nice. Same for this one. They are solid, solid cards. And the parallels do look really good. This one is the 99. What a pack. As I always say, if you're interested in any of the cards you see here, make sure to shoot me a message as well. But as you can see, 86 of 99. And 44 of 200. Bang. Third box, lucky. And we have one more. Interesting boxes these. Maybe they do go up a little bit in value. Maybe they could. Who knows? I am liking this. At least they're a fun rip. They're not expensive and they're fun to open, so that is definitely a good thing. Not sure what that the mere auto is worth. It could be worth a shit ton. Oh shit, I just spoiled it for myself. Well, recapri at the back to 275. I just completely ruined it. So there you go. I think that means no auto, unless that is an auto. Nope. There we go. The 275, once again, pretty much the same box as that Jordi Alba card. Rika Puy to 275. Fun boxes, definitely fun boxes. We have a Testegen to 75. A Jordi Alba and Rika Puy to 275. And then box number three with the big bangers. The Mir Auto to 200 and a Pedri to 99. Bang, bang. There we go. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. As I always say, if you want to see me open anything else, make sure to leave it in the comments. I will be reading them, of course. And um, thank you all for watching. Leave a like. Peace.